concerned. Ixa, his attorney, says that George Anthony has regained the will to live. But as you mentioned, the very investigators who are credited with saving his life are going back to asking tough questions once again, specifically about the Anthony family. Some of the very same investigators credited with saving George Anthony's life after he disappeared now have to resume their investigation. And that includes asking questions about what Lee Anthony knew about Kaylee's disappearance and when. The good people out there want to do whatever we can, and they've offered up their unconditional support and resources. We kind of treat him separately, a source close to the investigation tells us. He knows what he's done. That source would not say whether charges would be coming against him. Meanwhile, the attorney for George and Cindy Anthony says the strain of waiting so long to bury Kaylee was a contributing factor to George's desire to harm himself. In our culture, burying your loved one is, is one of the biggest steps towards healing. And they have not been able to do that. They Conway says the outpouring of love and compassion is bringing George Anthony out of the woods. And he does have that will to live and survive, and he knows that he's got something way beyond what he's gone through to offer to other people that will go through it and that are going through it. At Kaylee's memorial, Leona Lieber says she had the same thoughts when her son died. When I lost my son, I just wanted to be with my son, just like George wants to be with Kaylee. Meanwhile, their attorney says, George Anthony's attorney says that his recovery is going to depend on his ability to know that he will be able to bury Kaylee soon. That's why Brad Conway says he's going to get on that first thing in the morning. Reporting live in downtown Orlando, Orange County, Bob Keeley, West 2 News.